The aim of the study was to find out more about men's experiences around infertility. We still don't know that much about what matters to men in relation to going through infertility. So we conducted this study in partnership with Fertility Network UK, the national charity for infertility in the UK. The study was an online questionnaire, so we asked men to complete that questionnaire anonymously um, and we asked a broad range of questions about infertility, so their emotional experiences around it, any impact it might have had on their relationships, various aspects that it might have impacted on their lives to really get a broad sense of what was important to men. This particular research project is part of a wider programme of research on men and infertility and one of the other studies we're looking at is around the lifestyle advice that men are presented with online and how they actually change their behaviours to improve their chances of fertility in the future. The key findings from the study were that uh, men are, are deeply impacted by infertility with impacts on their well-being but also on their relationships with their intimate partners and friends and families. They often feel they can't talk to other people about what they're going through. Fertility and fatherhood are really important traditionally for men and masculinity, so men's identity and self-esteem was deeply affected by the process of infertility. In light of the findings from the study, we really need to think more about how men might be supported better when they're going through infertility so that they're able to access the advice and information that they might need and that they're able to interact with peers who might be going through a similar experience which might be beneficial to them. We also need to think more about the settings in which that, that will occur in, so whether that's online or in face-to-face -face ways, so that men are able to access what's meaningful support for them.